Hello guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. This is the first time I'm trying to share my view and opinion about the books I read recently. It's called Homage to Catalonia by George Orwell. This is just a wonderful book. Like all of Orwell's work it's incredibly well written. It's a very powerful piece of prose. Usually this book is seen as a picturesque account of an ultimately failed attempt to fight fascism, but what made a big impression on me was the fact that people like Orwell and 30,000s other foreign volunteers went to fight fascism in Spain at all. It's in such contrast to the way we think politics works now. In those days people realized that to fight fascism you had to go risk your own life. Thousands of foreign volunteers didn't return from Spain. These days, we're led to believe that signing our name on an internet petition is really going to end genocide in Darfur. That was the contrast that really hit home to me in that book. Homage to Catalonia is George Orwell's personal account of his experiences during the Spanish Civil War. Published in 1938, the book reflects on Orwell's time fighting as a volunteer with the PUM, Partido Obrero de Unificación Marxista, Militia and his observations of the political atmosphere in Catalonia. Orwell's writing style is straightforward, honest, and deeply reflective. He vividly describes his arrival in Barcelona, the enthusiasm he witnesses among the local population, and his initial commitment to the Republican cause. However, as the story progresses, Orwell becomes disillusioned with the political infighting and the manipulation of power within the Republican faction. One of the most notable aspects of Homage to Catalonia is Orwell's ability to paint a vivid picture of the chaos and confusion of war. He provides detailed descriptions of his time on the front lines, the constant fear and danger, and the lack of resources faced by the militias. Orwell presents a realistic and unromanticized view of war, showing the realities faced by those on the ground rather than glorifying the experience. While the book primarily focuses on the political situation and Orwell's personal observations, it also delves into the power struggles between various factions within the Republican side. Orwell's disillusionment with the Communist Party's dominance and their suppression of other leftist groups, including the PUM, is a recurring theme throughout the book. Homage to Catalonia also offers valuable insights into the nature of propaganda during wartime. Orwell reflects on his own experiences with biased reporting and the manipulation of information by both Republican and nationalist forces. His background as a journalist strongly influences the book, as he critically examines the role of the media in shaping public opinion during moments of conflict. Throughout the narrative, Orwell's own growth and transformation can be seen. His initial idealism is gradually replaced by a more nuanced understanding of the complexities of politics and war. This personal journey adds depth to the text, making it more than just a dry historical account. Overall, I would say that Homage to Catalonia is a compelling and thought-provoking book that provides a unique perspective on the Spanish Civil War. Orwell's clear and engaging writing style, combined with his insightful analysis of the political and social landscape, make it one of the best classic book to read.